Greetings from Google Academy UK and in this quick video we're going to be verifying our website and putting in Google Analytics into the edit.php file which is quite easily. First go into Google Analytics, tracking info, tracking code. So I've already got it highlighted, copy that. Filezilla, head of PHP, I'm in my child theme. You want to be in your child theme by now. Download this. It might tell me one's open. I need to discard it. It might not. Let's have a look. Where have we gone there? There we go. Is that it? Is that it? Let's look in the downloads folder. It looks like we've got a few of these open at the minute. Right, header. Yes. Right. <coughs> Here we go. So what we're going to be looking for is this here, the closing head tag. Let's put a couple of lines in between that. Paste in your code that you just copied. You can tab it over, I would have presumed. No, you can't tab it over. Like if you're bothered about it, you can space it over and everything, but that's the main thing. <coughs> Save, and then we're just going to upload this. Let's just see where we saved it as to make sure first. Downloads there. Right, and then we want to go back into downloads there. Refresh the files. And then, I bet it's that on there. Let's look. 132, 131. It keeps changing its text. I'll tell you, I'm going to try and put this one up and see what happens. Yeah, it's putting both at the same look. That's bizarre, but it's doing that when you download it. So let's just see by. Can I show that? Can I show that one copy in there as well? Can I show that? Let's try view edit. Discard it, and then it's probably going to give us this problem, but it's in there, look. So that's a little bit bizarre. Maybe it saved that copy and went in. But now what we want to do is the checkers website and look in the page source. Let's go back to the home page. Best way to find this amongst all that carnage is to copy a universal analytics card. Hit control and F. Control and V, and here we can see it. Where it's been pasted, it doesn't seem to be doing in the end where we were looking for it, but it's put it there anyway. Oh, I'm on one of four. Property ID, and that must be from something like Page Speed Insights. Insights, you can give you a metric. Huh. So now we've got it twice, but that's possibly because, here look. Developers site verification. I've already verified it here by uploading an HTML file. So my analytics could follow it anyway, but for you who haven't done this perhaps and you need to get this onto your site, that's how we do it. You just go into your child theme, find your editor, download that, well, view edit it, whichever, whether for that. Paste that code in before the closing head yeah and that's it for google analytics you can receive in traffic in past 48 hours have we actually had anyone more let's see overview oh, we're a new site anyway so as you can see we're not super busy what countries we come from let's have a look ah United States, Canada, Belgium, Switzerland, India, Italy, so we're getting out there for all Facebook and places like that. Anyway, if you found this useful, please leave a comment. If you've got any questions, do leave them and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. As always, stay safe, stay safe. Regards from Ramsgate, United Kingdom. Oh, it's 1.35 in the morning as well. I probably should go to bed.